hello guys welcome back to another video in this video i'm going to show you how you can actually add uh, i mean integrate admin template so this is basically like uh, the bef i mean like before uh, we have actually done front end integration right html template so i will actually provide you a download link in the description so that you can download this so now let's go extract it and here you can see admin template now we will actually uh, here we have documentation template we have assets so i'm going to cut it uh, cut everything from here or let's say copy so what i have to do you have to actually uh, go inside of this folder we have just extracted here you can see this one and then go inside it and then go for the template so double click on it and go inside template and just copy everything okay from here and let's go back to the project directory jam then st docs then hospital then public and then here i'm going to create a folder and that would be let's say admin okay admin underscore and let's say and i will keep everything here here we have uh, you know all the pages here you can see uh, all the pages and everything so if i double click on it index.html so this is the dashboard basically right so let's go add it uh, i will actually go to the core editor here you can see we have a hospital here and then if i go to the public then we have admin end right so now uh, i'm going to go to the index html here and i'm going to copy everything Control c then i will go to the resources okay then views then inside admin i'm going to create a new file the file will be main design main design dot design dot here i'm going to paste everything and we know our we have to actually change the links also right all the link i mean reference here you can see these are start from assets but if i go to the public then admin and here you can see before asset we have admin end also right so let's add admin end in every reference so i'll say admin underscore end slash now i'll copy it and paste it in every single references so done and inside we have you know images and all the stuff so i don't actually want to you know add their uh you know i mean I, I don't want to work with it because we can actually we may uh, remove you know uh, a lot more things from this design so uh, before that uh if i go to the project dashboard here you can see this is the admin dashboard but we haven't actually uh integrated the template yet so what i have to do so this is the main design right and in the dashboard we can actually extend the design now okay so let's go uh, remove it and i'm going to say add extends and here i'm going to say main design so the main design is now inside admin right so i'll say admin dot main design and uh, now here uh, i'll actually create a section if we need anything here but before that let me check the uh, design is changed or not and here you can see the design is changed for the dashboard and here we will actually show the username so let's change it uh, so what i'm going to do i'm going to go to the main design here and uh, so we haven't actually fetch anything yet so we are going to fetch everything from the database but uh, now let's just uh, go with the template first okay so i'm going to remove everything uh, from the for the body so let's go we'll just keep this part okay so we'll uh, you know make separate uh, pages for all this stuff we will uh, take uh, only uh, this sidebar and the top bar okay this navigation or nav bar or whatever you say uh, we'll just keep uh, these two part in the main design other than uh, these two part we'll actually remove everything from the body uh, i mean from the main design okay so let's go to the main design and here we are going to keep only the header and sidebar okay so we'll go for the body part let me search the body okay uh, card body here you can see card body visitors by country visitors by country so let me inspect it so this is the targeted div here you can see content over main panel okay so we have to go for the main panel so guys let's go here i will search main panel and here you can see main panel ends here so this is the main panel 
and uh, what i'm going to do i'm going to actually remove uh, everything from the main panels so that we can actually cut it from here and we can create a new page for it it's lengthy process so now we can actually cut it from here cut okay done now we are going to create a new uh, file in the admin panel and here we will say main body sorry main body dot blade dot HP. paste it here and now if we need it we will actually extend it right we can extend the main part also before that let me refresh now body part should gone right yeah i can see and now you may actually keep what you need in the sidebar and in the top bar i don't need this button and this this and this button so we can actually keep this drop down here for the logout and all the settings right so we'll remove this one this one this one and this one go okay, here uh, so this is the main body i will remove it for now and uh, here you can see logout so here uh, we have settings logout profile so profile right profile settings and then logout right so let's go for the logout at first so we'll go uh, to the resources okay then views then layouts then navigation and here we will search for logout and we'll find a form like this so i'm going to copy this let's go there main design okay and in the main design we'll actually go for the logout here you can see and we'll add uh, so this is the paragraph tag right so we'll add here a form logout let's just see how it looks like refresh and if i click here here you can see we have logout option here right okay so we will go at the top and from here we are going to remove this uh, uh, div okay drop down here you can see settings and so on i don't need this and done and item preview so it's okay we have here advanced setting i'm going to remove this so this is for what drop down item right so this is the logout danger option so i'm going to remove this also that's it refresh click here and here you can see we have logout option here right okay so we have profile and logout option you can actually click on logout so it will be logged out okay done and maybe we can actually remove this div also to remove extra spaces What is happening here? So we have logout option here, right? Okay, done. Now, logout option is done, and uh, so we can actually fetch the username from the database, right? Here. So we'll do it later. Uh, for now, let's say Yamin. Mean. Okay and then see all notification i don't need this div so i, I may actually uh, uh, remove this you know list from here so let's remove this list and i don't need the new message also let's remove this deep list also sorry and done refresh so we have this one and this one I mean the emails right okay so let's remove this two option here you can see uh, this one i will remove this list and then uh, we have here drop down reference so i will actually remove this so this is anchor tag for oh, which one i'll actually remove this okay that's it and done I made a mistake so let's undo it okay done so that's it okay so you may actually give here you know route so that if anyone click on here in the name it should go somewhere 
so you may actually give route from the routes or dot php and here you can actually select any profile route okay profile uh, like like this profile dot edit and then we have yamin we have image so maybe we can actually show image from the you know uh from the database also but we haven't actually created image column for the user so we'll actually remove it we don't need any image here and uh, that's it okay now we can actually log out from here right okay so guys uh, actually it depends on you how many item actually you want to keep here and how many item uh, i mean you can actually keep right so uh, we'll actually add just only uh, i mean i i think i should keep this one only okay so so that i can actually go for let's say add doctors and so many things so yeah that's it i'm going to remove all of them except this one user pages okay so let's go to the sidebar i will actually type here sidebar maybe yeah here you can see uh, sidebar and here in the nav we have a gold member what is gold member let's remove this and then here you can see profile drop down for the first link i don't need this so i can actually uh, remove this one list okay this list you know the menu dashboard basic ui elements i want to actually remove this remove you will actually i mean we'll keep only the user pages right yeah you can see user pages so let's remove all of them before i mean let's remove all the list okay start from here this list before the user pages okay so let's remove all of them and here you can see from here okay done now save it let's go refresh here you can see we have only one option user pages and then we have documentation so we don't need this so we'll actually remove it also done now we can actually change this all the things here according to our needs okay that's it so guys now uh, if i create any page in the admin views it said resources views and then admin i can actually extend main design and now let's say i need the body so i can actually include it in any design okay that's it so that's it for today uh, we have implement the admin panel right admin template if I log out and it's also working so that's it thank you so much for watching